got Shadow Fax 1's barrel here and I'm going to slug it and just like with neuter 10 millimeters barrel I nicked the bottom of the bullet here put a little bit of uh, WD-40 on it and I marked the 6 o'clock position and I'll be using a pencil to uh, as a dowel to drive that sucker and it doesn't have to be exact so I'm going to do the same thing, take the same, measure, same measurements as I did for uh, neuter 10 millimeter. Uh, I'm going to do this on the floor because it's kind of springy in here. But first, a little refreshment. A little Yingling Premium. It's a staple of the uh, Pennsylvania uh, residency here. So, cheers. All right, be right back. Well, I blew out my pencil, so uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use a couple of brass casings to uh, push it back out. There it goes. And it's pretty nice. It came out pretty good. Nice and shiny. All right, so let's mic it. All right, I'm going to call it 4.02. So the back of his barrel is 4.02. Let me get the chamber. All right, let's measure the chamber now. So I'm going to go uh, 6 and 12. So the vertical position. 6 and 12, and I get point, point four two eight. Point four two eight right there. Okay, and then I'm going to turn it 90 degrees, and I'm getting for the um, 3 and 9, 3 o'clock and 9, I get, it's actually smaller, 0.427, so let me turn it 90 again. Just to make sure. Nope, 0 0.428. Alright, 90 again. And I get 0 0.4275. So they're about 5 ten thousandths difference so definitely a smaller difference than neutered 10 millimeters barrel all right let's slug the front of the barrel okay well the front of the barrel uh, didn't go very far in so it just kind of fell right out so let's uh let's mic it and see what we get what i'm doing is i'm twisting it ever so slightly and if i get resistance i'll back up a little bit there we go And right there, I'm getting uh, getting right at three nine four zero. Oh. I'm getting right at four point zero. Oh. Right there, or point four zero. Oh. Point four zero oh on that one. So Let me reset. At yeah, three nine nine five. So. 3995 to 3.3995 to 0.40 is about what it's running. Yeah, I'd have to say that 3995 is probably as close as I'm going to get. Um, of course, 5 ten thousandths is, is probably within the error of the dial caliper. So I'll shoot those numbers up. Uh, I'll look, and along with the specification numbers and it is what it is so I'm gonna clean this barrel up and send it back to Shadow Facts 1 and thank you very much for the use of the barrel I thoroughly enjoyed the testing and thanks for watching guys later alright 
clean it up real nice. See that in there? And uh, this is the condition. I will be shipping this thing back. Um, first, what I'm going to do is I'm going to give it a nice WD-40 bath. Inside and outside. There. I'm going to wrap it like a baby. And then, put it in this bag here. So, there you go. That's, <clears throat> that's what it should look like when you get it. So, I will get it in the mail tomorrow. Hopefully you will get it either Monday or, or Tuesday. So, again, thanks for the use of the barrel and the testing. I learned a lot, and um, hope you enjoyed the videos. Bye.